Okay, so what we're going to do here is we're given a quadratic relation. We need to put this into standard form. Oh, it's negative one, sorry. We need to put this equation into standard form. So we need to expand, right? So remember this from the beginning of the chapter? X plus 3 squared, how do I write that out? X plus 3 times X plus 3. And then we have this subtract 1 at the end. X times X, and then X times 3, and then 3 times X, 3 times 3. X times X is X squared. 3 times X, then 3 times X again, then 3 times 3, and then we have to take away 1 at the end, right? That was outside of the bracket. Simplify. I can combine these, yep. So it becomes X squared plus 3 plus 3, 3X plus 3X. 9 take away 1, 8. Okay, everyone agree? This is standard form. We just turned this into standard form. Now we're going to put this into factor form. So this is good review. Do you guys know how to uh, factor this? Okay. Now we have to put this into factored form. We have a trinomial in the form x squared plus bx plus c. So we're looking for two things that multiply to give us positive 8 and adds up to positive 6. Factors of 8. 4 times 2 is 8. What's 4 plus 2? That was easy. Factored form then. How do I write this in factored form? x plus 4 and x plus 2. It's now in factored form. Can you guys tell me the x-intercepts? Negative, negative 4 and negative 2. That's it. Okay, so we know this because it was written in factored form here. Okay, so we need to expand first. x plus 1 squared means x plus 1 times x plus 1 plus the 32. We'll deal with that at the end. This is what you're multiplying first, okay? So we have the negative 2 x times x, x times 1, 1 times x, 1 times 1, plus the 32 at the end. I can simplify what's in my bracket because I have like terms. 1x plus 1x is 2x. Okay, still not touching this plus 32. Now I have to distribute this negative 2. Multiply it by everything inside the bracket only. So what's negative 2 times x squared? Negative 2 times positive 2x. Negative 2 times positive 1 plus 32. Okay? Can you simplify this? Like terms. y equals negative 2x squared minus 4x plus 30. That's it for standard form, okay? This is in standard form. Okay, look here, please. So you just put the equation into standard form. Okay, so it's in standard form. We have to put it into factored form. Look for a greatest common factor. Negative 2. There you go. So everything can be divided by negative 2. So we're going to have negative 2. What's inside the bracket? This cancels out, so we have x squared. What's negative 4 divided by negative 2? Positive 2x. A positive divided by a negative. 30 divided by 2. Okay, so we can still factor this, looking for two things that multiply together to give us negative 15 and adds up to positive 2. Okay. Negative 5 and positive 3 equals negative 2, so that doesn't work. Try positive 5 and negative 3. That adds up to 2. This one works. So what is this in factored form? Y equals negative 2 bracket. Bracket. X minus 3. And this is the equation in factored form. Made with DoodleCast Pro.